Translate them in, in Arabic, not if you can. Uh, so just go to oh, this is John, John 1. Yeah, yeah. John okay. 15, yeah, verse yeah. 16. I'm going to ask him a question. Yes, yes, go ahead. This, this is John 15, right? John 15, verse 13. Just listen to this and then you can ask your okay. question. Just verse what? Verse 13. 15, uh, so that's 13. 19. No, 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 you're there. Oh, here, oh, here they are small. 13. Verse 13. 6, 9, 11. Greater love has no listen, one. Listen to this. Greater love has no one than this, that someone lay down his life for his friends. يعني ما في حب أكبر من إنه واحد يضحي بنفسه عشان صديقه. I don't love you. <laughs> so Jesus says. So the greatest love is like yeah, exactly. sacrifice. For There's no greater love than for someone to die for you. So Jesus is like is the greatest, the greatest basically because he died for the humanity. That's it. That's it. That's cool. That's nice. But yeah, he had a question though. Yeah. Uh, okay. Should I ask for Alec? Simple, uh, simple question. Okay. He, he, he is looking at the moment. No, 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 no. Okay. No. Just I was thinking about something else. هو سمبل كويشن هو هو بيقول لك هو بيقول لك انه جيسس ضحى بحياته عشان عشان طيب انا انا هاي يعني قول انا هاي اول مره اسمعها انا كثير واقف مع عالم بس انه هاي اول اس از ذا فيرست تايم اي هير اس فيرست تايم اي هير لايك جيسس هي داي فور بيبل اور ار يو ليفينج ان ا كيف مان يا سو جو جو هوم Read the NG. You need to read this. Read the no, no. You need it as well. Okay, but, you can give him a copy. But he, his English is not that good. I don't mind giving him the whole Bible. No, he can explain me. <laughs> okay, oh, there my, you go. okay. There you my go. English, like, not like my cousin. He know everything, you know. Oh, yeah. no, I don't know. No, no. He speak good because he know about the religion. He know. Oh, your explain. English is good, man. No, no. Yeah, but not like Here. my cousin. Even you know, I can't talk, but I can reading. Yeah. So it's better he can explain me. But okay. I just like so read the question. That's how he say like it's first time in my life I hear Jesus, he died like for a people or for a human. You. That's it's yeah, first time everyone. I hear for, for everyone. It's the first time I hear. Amen. Glory to God. That's good. That's good. So read the Gospel of John. Explain it to him, so he understands it. You understand it because I was there one time. I understood it, and by the grace of God, my whole life changed. Did you see his face? If you're a believer, I know that that impacted you on some level. To watch the realization of this message that this poor man has missed out on. And it, it, I guess on some level is surprising because as a believer, you feel like the gospel is just like out there in the world. Everybody's heard it. You know, everybody knows about Jesus who died for their sins and... And yet, I recently saw another video where people are on the streets being asked, Has anybody shared the gospel with you? <laughs> and to think of how many people have never heard. They've never heard the truth. And even for the most part, when the gospel, the gospel is going out, it's a watered-down false gospel. So if you are somebody who knows the truth, I hope that this gives you something to really think about, especially when you watch, watch that man's face to realize this, this is the gospel. This is the message. Nobody's ever told me this, that the King of Kings left his estate in the, in the glory of the father to come down here into this cesspool and suffer in a way we will never really understand. And he did so for everybody, for his enemies. And he did it so that the grave will not hold us. And in the end, all will be resurrected. Not everybody will be resurrected to eternal life. Learn what the first resurrection is. Learn what the truth of the gospel is. 
because there is one narrow path. As the Lord Jesus said, you, there is no other way to enter into the sheepfold, and that entry is through death, and we have to follow him through death in order to follow him to everlasting life. Pray for especially Muslims, because they're, they believe that they believe in the Abrahamic God, even though they have their own version of what that means, and many of them just don't realize. They don't realize how much of a counterfeit they've been fed, and they don't realize the mercy that's available to them. And what a gift to have that mercy and that grace. Mercy is when we don't receive something that we deserve. Grace is when we do deserve, or when we do receive something that we don't deserve. And that comes from Christ alone. He is the way, the truth, and the life. And there is so much in those words that I don't have time for this, for that in this video right now, but I saw this and I just thought, wow, look at this man's face when he realizes what, what message he's been missing for all of his life. It's a big deal.